Hi, I'm Sabine from Porsche and in this video I'd like to show you the different driving modes of the Taycan. Depending on the model year and equipment, the following common driving modes can be selected. Range is for efficient and consumption optimized driving. In this driving mode, the top speed is limited to a range of 90 to 140 km per hour, but can always be overruled by pressing the accelerator pedal. The normal driving mode is for everyday use. The Taycan delivers its power output on a linear basis. Sport driving mode is for higher performance and higher dynamics orientation. If your vehicle is equipped with Sport Chrono, you also have the option to choose between Sport Plus and Individual. Sport Plus is for maximum performance. The focus here is on the dynamics with performance-oriented settings such as for the chassis, Porsche Active Aerodynamics and the temperature regulation of the performance battery. Individual is a driving mode that you can configure according to your personal preferences and which is then saved individually for you. The Taycan Cross Turismo has the additional gravel mode for unpaved roads like gravel or mud. This drive mode optimizes the control of a wide range of vehicle components including traction optimized shifting, damper and spring rates, Porsche stability management, Porsche Torque Vectoring Plus, and Porsche Traction Management. And now I will show you how to activate the different driving modes. Let's get into our Taycan. One possibility for changing the driving mode is via the Porsche Communication Manager. Therefore, go to Vehicle, select Drive, and go to Drive Mode. And here you can select your desired driving mode. If you want to configure the individual mode, select the three dots on the right side and go to individual drive mode configuration. If your car is equipped with the Sport Chrono package, you can also use the mode switch on the steering wheel. To activate, turn the mode switch to the desired drive mode. The selected drive mode is then displayed on the instrument cluster. Last but not least, if your Taycan Cross Turismo is equipped with the Sport Chrono package, you can activate the gravel mode via the center console. All other models have a sport mode shortcut. Of course, you can also change certain settings while driving in the different modes. Let me explain this using range mode as an example. Driving in this mode means driving with the most efficient all-wheel distribution available. For efficiency reasons, it is not possible to activate launch control. The basic recuperation setting is deactivated and the suspension is set to low. The maximum speed is limited and only second gear is used. The Porsche electric sport sound is turned off and the air conditioning is set to Eco or Eco Plus. Porsche Active Aerodynamics work in the most efficient way and even the assistance systems such as adaptive cruise control operate in a way that optimizes range. So if you want to change range mode settings, again select the vehicle tile, go to drive mode and select range mode and here you can adjust the possible settings. In range mode, you can adjust advanced settings by clicking on the three dots. You can increase the maximum exceedable speed of the Taycan, for example, up to 140 km per hour, as well as the air conditioning according to your personal preferences. It is important to know that the charging plan is adjusted and the optimal route is recalculated with the new settings if necessary. Thank you for joining me in getting to know your vehicle better and seeing you in the next video.